Welcome to Penang Hill. We're going hiking today. So it is just the two of us in the car because we are going on a date, uh, a hiking date. <laughs> We left the two kids at home because this hike is pretty um, really uphill just all stairs and it looks like it's gonna be pretty muddy because we decided we wanted to go hiking in the rainy season and it's actually been raining we're hoping it's not gonna start raining too hard that we can't actually go <laughs> um, but we will see how this goes uh, we have not gone hiking together in years, but we used to go a lot. <laughs> so we're trying something new-ish. We've been on this hike before and it's very steep. It's a lot of stairs, pretty muddy. We'll see how well maintained it is right now and we'll take you with us to see what it's like hiking in the jungle during the rainy season. Hopefully there won't be a downpour while we're on the trail. We'll see. <laughs> All right. Making sure it gets recorded on the Watch. Yeah, because they said in nursing school, if it's not recorded, it's not done. Oh no. <laughs> Gotta record. We already came up here. Might be able to hear the music. I think there's probably Zumba going on in the park. I don't really know what this hike is called. We call it the Penang Hill hike. But there's a bunch of different trails that lead up Penang Hill. And I don't think this is really the main one. This is the Youth Park Trail. Maybe I need to research and figure out what this is actually called. Nice little trail through the jungle here. Got a bridge. We do have our umbrella. In case it starts to downpour. So how does it feel to be hiking this without carrying 30 pounds plus Glenn in the front pack? It feels like I'm doing this for myself now. <laughs> I don't know, I guess. Doing this for yourself? What? Okay, before I was bringing the kids, I'll have fun. <laughs> Parents can just hike. Uh huh. We made it to a flat part. Hiking in the rain has some advantages, right? not crazy hot. It's not hot. Still steep, but I'm kind of amazed. We're hiking and it's not so hot you feel like you're gonna die. That's nice. I appreciate it. You need to look where I'm going. Don't get so close, there's no reason to step up. This is slippery. That's a pretty far, that far. Harder ways in life. The hard shortcuts? The hard shortcuts. So you work harder for this amount of time. Instead That's of you just work a long time. That's always your exercise philosophy. Yes. That's why you're a runner, right? Oh, look. Whoa. Oh. Come on, let's go. Whole family of them. Got the whole family of monkeys. Watching all of us humans walking the trail. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> Why don't you stay where you live? Leave us alone. This 
trail is easier than I remember it being. Or maybe I'm in better shape. It's been my theory recently that the babies are actually making me in better shape because I have to carry them and chase them all the time. So if it were up to me, I'd spend my whole days just reading books. So you think this is a good idea? Me? Yeah. What? Oh, this is all the shortcuts. All the shortcuts. You don't fall back, you fall forward and you just scrape the whole way down. Because if you fall back, you hit your head. Okay, maybe it doesn't look that crazy for me, but. We made it to station five. There's really only stations three and five. But it has been a long, long time since I've made it up here. By the end, we were not saying that this was so easy. There's a lot of stairs at the end. We are very high. I don't know if we can really see. In real life, we can see the water. I don't think it shows up on the camera. It's a pretty clear view. Oh, we can see it oh, from here, yeah. It's not too bad. Yeah. We can see the mainland. Mm-hmm. You can see across the mainland. All right. It's pretty cool. From, if we go down to station three, I think we can get a better view. This is the rest spot. Yeah, it's busier up here than you would expect. There's like a whole gym up here, mm -hmm. which makes me think, how in the world did all that heavy equipment come up here? <laughs> And who wants to work out after climbing that whole thing? People that are more in shape than us? No, people that are serious about their workouts. Not serious. That is definitely not us. We did not skip leg day today. No. But there's a bunch of exercise equipment and a little tea shop. For those who want to work out after hiking for a really long time. Wait, oh, here? Uh, yeah, but I think we go around the other way. I'm not sure if it connects. Does it connect? Now when you don't take the, the shortcuts, this is the view that you get to have from just below station three. which we did not see on the way up because we decided to do the shortcut route. You could see the new land development. Oh, yep. That's so cool, the way they dredge. <laughs> because dredging is innovative. Okay. Right. So there's a traffic jam. Because this cow decides that he can just cross the road oh. wherever it wants. <laughs> Why did the cow cross now there's, the road? Now there's one in front of us, there's another one on their road. Oh yeah, there's, there's, oh he had to go, oh it was to be with her friends. Oh and there's, there's a whole bunch of cows. Hey, cows. Whoa, 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 careful. <laughs> It was a fun hike. We're glad we went. It was a fun day outing, but Angel spent probably the whole second half um, saying that he thinks we should bring Cyrus. Yes. Like, tonight. Tonight. We'll do it again. <laughs> and do it again. It's not that hard. But I think it would be better, though, if we don't take the shortcuts when we do it with Cyrus, because the stairs are what you're going to have to carry him on. But if, we, if you don't take all the shortcuts, you can avoid a lot of the stairs. Thanks so much for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and you can subscribe to Seven and All Adventures, our new 
family vlog channel. Bye!